Hey, fishy people. Um, just doing an update. Uh, the fish room. I've got, um, you know, th things are growing in nicely. Uh, I've, I've got a bigger update in a sec, but I'm just going to do a quick vid of all the different tanks. Here's the African cichlids. As you can see, it's, it's filled in, you know, pretty nice. Uh, looking a lot better than right after my move. Which I guess was well ago now, so I should stop talking about it. Um, 40 gallon. Big 100 gallon. Uh, my light always kind of interferes with the video on this. I always apologize. But um, ferns in here are just going nuts. Real happy with that. I've got, um, I'm going to butcher this name, but Styrogyron Repins or S Repins, the uh, low carpeting stem plant down here. Uh, also, some D Denoy, Denau coming in. Got that a couple places. Uh, it's really taken off. I, I just recently put this in here and um, Baby plant, baby plant, those are both new on this big one. There's a couple baby plants around the base. So excited about that because I like that plant. And uh, hard to get from my distributors. Um, 100 gallon tank. Still need to escape this. I, I, ha I need to, you know, I, I need to do this tank. I, I just haven't yet. But right now it's holding sponge filters which are cycling for the. Uh, the new project I'm doing. Um, in here I've got my sunfish. He, he's a terrible looking fish now because he was picking on my electric catfish. Got shocked a little hard. Got knocked out. Crayfish ate his tail off. Brought him back. Um, twin spot puffer right there. He is very, very mean. Uh, really not the most pleasant fish to have. I, I might have to rehome him at some point. And then the electric catfish down here. Um, 100 gallon shrimp tank. Got a nice big sword in there. It's, it's recently put in there, so it, it needs to open. But I got the four leaf clover carping out. A um, couple crips. I, I got a ton of shrimp in there. I don't, you probably can't see them, but if you see anything moving, it's it's a shrimp. There's uh, there's one, and there's one, and there's one, and there's one and there's one and there's one. These are just ones on the glass, but they're they're everywhere. I've got probably 600 shrimp in there. Um, and then the new addition. This is what I'm excited about. This is a shrimp breeding rack. I've got 25.5 gallon tanks. That's what all the sponge filters for are for. I've got a whole bucket more of them right here. Um, got. I don't know how many hundreds of pounds of substrate outside, more than I need. Uh, just filled two up so far. <clears throat> um, you know, taking temperature readings. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping I'm not going to have to run the AC in here too often, but I might. And that's, you know, without any heaters on these. These are all separate tanks. I'm not doing a system. I'm keeping them all separate just on sponge filters. If I have a tank collapse, it's going to be a single tank collapse. It's going to be a pain to top off, but that's why I have these acrylic sheets up top. Um, but I'm excited. I'm, I'm doing a whole bunch of different shrimp. I'm doing a bunch of painted fire reds because I just I love my high grade cherry shrimp. I'm doing crystals. I'm doing low grade crystals. Well, not like C grade, but I'm doing A through S grade. Um, I'm doing triple S grade. I'm doing blue diamonds. Uh, blue pearls, possibly some shadow pandas, uh, gold bees, Indian tigers, white backs, um, Indian white backs. Uh, I'm doing a bunch of shrimp. Um, what else am I doing? Orange reallys. I'm doing. Uh, did I say orange eye blue tigers? A lot of shrimp. I'm excited. I've got 20 tanks, so uh, I'm, I'm not just going to have 
different types, but a bunch of different grades of similar types. Maybe blue bolts. I don't know about those. They're, they're kind of expensive, and honestly, they're not my favorite. Looks-wise, um, same with black crystals. I should probably do those just for the sake of it, but I, I, I'm, not, I'm not into the crystal blacks. I don't know why. Um, going to be doing yellow sakuras, because I already have that. I, that's what I have going in this tank over here, a bunch of yellow sakuras. I've got painted fire reds, those are gonna intermix, so I gotta get some of them out of there at some point, or I'm just gonna let this be a, a bastard tank and say, screw it, this is for breeding and that's just for show. Um, yeah, I'm excited, I, I gotta stop filming because I only have six minutes to go and uh, almost there, but I'm excited, you know, 20 tanks. Hopefully the uh, shrimp are going to be coming in in the next two weeks and then two weeks after that. So, hope your tanks are doing well. See you guys later. Bye.